This oversight is costing your small business thousands of dollars. When you own a small business, every penny you get counts because you want to be investing that money into new items. And honestly, we all have some things we could use some extra money for. Here's the big mistake you're making, not finding the best price shipping options for your customers. High shipping prices can turn away customers and cut into your profits. Do not just pick a method from the options on Etsy. Instead, look at the USPS website and other services like Pirate Ship to find the best price shipping options for each of your items. You may be surprised to find that items you're shipping in boxes could be shipped for way cheaper in padded envelopes, and items you're shipping in padded envelopes could be shipped for way cheaper in flats. You can save yourself thousands in the long run by optimizing your shipping now. My name is Bia, I'm the artist of Tinkalila Arts, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to save money on shipping. I use these tips for my small business, but even if you don't run a shop or any sort of small business yet, this video will still help you because sending packages at all can get expensive. I'm positive you can think of a time when you went to the post office to send a package to someone and you were shocked at how expensive shipping was. That's because you don't know the right methods to ship by and the post office wants to upsell you, and because you only have access to standard pricing, not commercial pricing. This is actually my first tip for you, get access to commercial pricing. Commercial pricing represents the most discounted shipping rates that the USPS offers. If you just walk into your post office and ask them to ship some packages for you, you are not getting this discount and you are losing money. Most services will charge you a monthly or yearly fee to get access to this discount, but you can actually get it for free. Etsy offers commercial discounts in their shipping options, and there is a great website called Pirate Ship that offers commercial discounts completely free of charge. Get onto one of these services and look at their prices to see how much money you'll be saving. Once you are on a service that has commercial pricing, you're gonna to want to get even more savings by using the best method for your packages. Again, services like Pirate Ship make this super easy. Just type in the dimensions and weight of your package and scroll through the different shipping options available for that package. This can vary so much, I've seen prices for the same large box that can go above $50 or below $10. You can choose cheaper options that will be just as fast or almost as fast as these expensive options. Finally, you should find out if you can reduce your shipping prices even further by changing what you send your items in. This is the most important tip here and it has saved my business so much money. Generally, boxes are more expensive to ship than padded envelopes and padded envelopes are more expensive to ship than flats. If you're shipping an item in a small box, check if it would be cheaper to ship that item in a padded envelope instead. If you have an item you're shipping in a padded envelope and it's small and less than one fourth of an inch thick, then you should be able to ship it in a flat envelope for even less. You can even get tracking on these flat envelopes. That's a service that I know Etsy offers. Take advantage of all the new knowledge you have on shipping now. Even just optimizing one or two of these things will help your business in the long run. Let me know in the comments, what issues do you have with shipping? It would be awesome if we could all share what we know in the comments and help each other out. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok at Tinkalila. See you next time. Picking the wrong shipping options is one of the big mistakes you can make with your business. If you want to learn what other mistakes artists make when starting an online shop, check out this video next.